Okay, in rugby union news, uh, Lee Halfpenny um, is going to miss the start of the Six Nations. He's still not fully recovered from a concussion he received on the 10th of November, was when he last played. Um, he was geared up to make his comeback uh, the other weekend and um, was declared unfit because he was suffering from dizzy spells and headaches, which is a uh, post-concussion syndrome. He's gone to see a specialist. The specialist has come back to the Welsh camp and said, no, um, he's got to be assessed in a month's time. Um, and he's going to be out for around five weeks, which means he's going to miss the start of the Welsh Six Nations campaign in three weeks' time, plus he'll miss the second game as well. Um, the other concern is his match fitness. Um, he would have been out um, for a, about three months by this point um, and hasn't played a game. Now, he has been in training, but he's not necessarily match fit. There's, 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 there's being fit and then there's match fit. So... That's another concern. However, Wales can absorb his loss better now than they could, um, let's say, three, four years ago. Um, Liam Williams can play on the wing or at fullback. You've got Anscombe, who can play at fullback as well. There's a host of other players who've, who've shown, especially in the last year's Six Nations, that they are ready to play at this level and they can play at this level in, in the back line. The one area where they could miss Lee Halfpenny um, is goal kicking, but, you know, the, the players that have been charged with goal kicking um, in his absence have also played exceptionally well and have slotted the penalties and the conversions and the drop goals as needed so yes he is going to be a miss he's an experienced player um, he's got a lot of caps behind him he's 30 years old he's one of the experienced leaders in the dressing room but the younger players are showing that they can step up to the plate. On Lee Halfpenny's side of things, it would be a shame if he has to retire because of concussion. He has had a lot of concussions in the past. Um, but it's got to be player safety comes first. And if that means he has to have an extended layoff, he has to have an extended layoff. Um, you know, it is a shame for, for him that he's going to miss the start of the Six Nations, but that doesn't mean he can't play a part towards the end of the tournament. Um you know, it is it is a five match tournament. It is a long tournament that goes from February to April. He could still play a part in, um, you know, the Welsh plans. But you know, in a World Cup year, you want your best players fit and ready and firing. So, if Warren Gatlin decides to protect him, say, look, we're not going to play you in this tournament. We're going to rest you up and we're going to use you in the World Cup. We're going to keep you, get you fit for the World Cup. So be it. Um, the issue is then he could lose his his, his place to a, a young, uh, talented player coming through who could nick his place and then he'll find it hard to get back in because we're seeing a lot with, with, with top-level pro sport. They're, going, they're getting younger and faster and they're putting younger players in um, a lot sooner um, at international and at top-flight level than they were five years ago. So Lee Halfpenny, when he is fit, could face a battle to get back in the side. And with Wayne Pivak replacing Gatland after the World Cup, could 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 he be out of Wales' plans? Uh, with players like Ansgar and Liam Williams, who can who can quite easily play at fullback, um, you know, without a blink of an eye. Um, but no, he is he has been assessed. He will go for another assessment in a month's time uh, to assess if he's ready to come back within the five week period. Um, but with concussion, it, it's diff it's a difficult condition to to say. You know, it's, an, it's a type of injury that can take, as I say, a long time to recover from. You, you can get over a concussion quite quickly, or if you've had a few of them, it can take longer for you to recover from. And then there's the post-concussion syndrome, and 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 the symptoms can creep up in you again. Um, so it's it's going to be interesting to see if if Halfpenny can come back uh, and and contribute to Wales. Uh, but there we go. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. Place your comments below, and I'll have some more videos for you soon.